Today I want to show you how to make this really sweet picket fence sign. And this is really unique because it uses a different material to make this picket fence and that is going to be paint stirs from the home improvement store. So I'll show you how quick and easy this is to make. All you need to do is start gluing things together. So these are the supplies that you are going to need. You're going to need three wooden paint stirs. You're going to need white paint, some glue. Um, you can use Mod Podge if you like, but it's not necessary. And then you're going to want some decals and twine. All right, so let's get started. First things first, you want to paint the paint stirs with white paint. This might take more than a couple coats, uh, but just go ahead and give them that white finish. Then I had a dowel that I cut into pieces and I hot glued it on the back of those paint stirs, which I had glued together side by side. Now the dowel is gonna add support so that they stay together and it doesn't flop over. You could actually take another paint stir or any other type of support to glue in the back if you want. Now it's time to choose the decals that you wanna put on your sign. I will put a link to these that I got on Amazon. You could also go to the Dollar Tree. They've had um, rub-on decals before, but just be sure that they are rub-on decals. And you wanna cut out the ones that you're gonna use. Now keep in mind, you can layer decals over each other, like I did. So you could have a tree branch that you put on first, and then you would put like a bird on top of that. So when getting the decals ready that you wanna use, just keep that in mind. Once you know the positioning, then go ahead and rub those decals on, lower layer first, and then any layers on top of that. You wanna rub with the item that was in the package of decals. Usually you get something. If you don't, you could always use like the back of a credit card or something, but just rub um, firmly but not too hard. And then there will be a protective cover. You wanna gently lift that cover up to see if the decal has stuck. If it hasn't, if it starts pulling up, then just put it down and just start gently rubbing again until it does stick. Now for the bottom, I wanted to add a cute little mini picket fence on top of my larger picket fence sign. This is something that is sold for fairy gardens. I think it just looks really cute to put on the bottom of the sign. You certainly don't have to if you don't want to. Again, I'll put list of supplies in the description below. Now after you put that little tiny mini fence on, um, just for some visual interest, I wrap some twine around the top. Just wrap it around a few times and knot it in the back and you're done. So now you can just either prop it against a wall for display or you could put a hook on the back if you wanted to to hang it up. This is a really simple craft idea. I love sharing more of these with you so be sure to subscribe if you want even more crafting ideas coming to you.